Well, there's huge community opposition to Doric's proposals for the redevelopment of the Westway Shopping Centre. And there's an obvious reason for that. It's because their proposals are completely out of character for Botley. The scale is just completely out of proportion for the area. At the moment, the properties are, for the most part, two storeys. The highest are three and four storeys high, whereas Doric's proposals are seven and eight storeys high. It would include the high, second highest building in the Vale. The density um, is just um, completely different to the current sort of open plan design that is, is in um, current um, use and allows um, real, real free flow for the community and lots of um, sort of community mixing and, and a real sort of community hub feel. And as a result of that, um, you know, there is real concern that um, we would lose what is essentially the heart of Botley to um, a monolithic, um, identical building. And, you know, residents don't want that. On top of that, there's very real concerns that local traffic infrastructure wouldn't cope with the development. Um, Botley Road is often gridlocked. The A34 um, has endless problems, as all of us know, when we sit on in traffic jams for endless hours. And um, anything that's going to make that worse um, needs to be um, properly assessed. And the Oxford County Council has um, put in an objection for that very reason. And I don't believe um, that Doric have come up with solutions for those problems. Um, I'm objecting. Um, for these reasons. Residents are objecting. Um, over a thousand residents have put an objection to the planning application. I believe that the Vale of the Whitehorse District Council should um, reject this application on those grounds. Personally, I think that there are some wonderful things that could be done to this um, shopping centre which would um, really um, upgrade it, which would give it a facelift, which would um, make it a much more modern, um, light, airy, um, better um, shopping centre. But I don't think that Dorrit's proposals are the right solution. And um, I think that the community um, agree rather loudly today as it happens. The campaigners have run an extraordinary campaign. They have just gathered momentum as they've gone along. They've got thousands of residents behind them and the community spirit which was on show today is really extraordinary and demonstrated that um, against all of the fashionable um, rhetoric that goes on in the newspapers, community spirit is alive and well here in Botley. And I really wish um, the Westway Community Concern all the best with their campaign to oppose this planning application. And um, I hope that um, they are successful in their aims to um, have the planning, Doric's planning application rejected. The worst victims of this whole process have been the field house residents who have been in a state of uncertainty about their future for over two years. While these plans have been considered, they don't know where they will be living at the end of this process. And for many vulnerable residents, this has been a really anxious time and is quite frankly an outrage. I have been quite clear with Sovereign Housing, with the Vale of Whitehorse District Council and with Doric that I consider this entirely unacceptable and I expect um, them to come to an agreement to be clear with Fieldhouse residents what their future will be, that it should only include one move if such a move is necessary. And for all Fieldhouse residents, I say that you do have um, representatives like myself, like your local councillors, like the Westway Community Concern who are standing up for you and we will do everything that we can to make sure that you have um, a safe and happy place to stay where you want to stay.